Alright, hey guys, it's G-Dogs, 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 and I'm show you guys how to put your iPad into DFU mode. Now, this is a relatively simple, simple procedure, but uh, for some reason, some iPads aren't working like they should, or aren't they aren't uh, doing it like they're supposed to. For some reason, it's not working. Alright, so, but I figured it out. I saw, cause I saw on YouTube videos on how to enter DFU mode that some people were having the exact same problem I was. Now, when you, uh, this is how you're supposed to enter DFU mode regularly. You hold your power button and you hold your home button. Oh shit. Hold your power and home button until it turns off. Then I wait three seconds. Now on the three seconds, the iPad logo is not supposed to turn on. It's supposed to stay off. On the three seconds, you let go of the, the power button and keep your hand on, keep your finger on the, the home button. But what ends up, ends up happening is, for some reason, for us users, us very special users, I guess, the iPad logo turns on on number three. But it's not supposed to, it's supposed to stay off. Alright, here's how it works. It's supposed to hold it for 10 seconds. Well, I, I don't usually do it for 10 seconds. I just do it for when it turns off, then count to three. One, two, three. See, right there, before I, before I could pull off my finger, it freaking uh, has that Apple logo. Which pisses me off. Okay, so this is what's supposed to happen. Alright, let's plug it in. Now that's how you enter DFU mode. You can do it from here, the home screen doesn't really matter. And then you plug it into your wall charger. There it is, your wall charger. Alright, so here you go. You hold it, power it home till it turns off, then count to three. And the three, you take off your finger. It doesn't have to be exactly on three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let go of the home button. I mean, the power button. And just hold it for about 15 seconds. About 15 seconds. Okay, make sure it's not less than 15 seconds. Not just kidding, I don't know. Just about. I don't know. I don't really count. I just know I hold this one longer. I don't have it to an exact science. But just hold it for 15 seconds just to be safe. I mean, it won't, it won't do anything if it doesn't. Alright, and that's it. Alright, now you disconnect it from your wall charger. And then you connect it. Oh, oh. Okay, watch this. Select my... Okay. I got my red snow open here. And I just boot it. Now when I connect it, it's gonna recognize it automatically and it'll bypass all this. As you can see, there you go. Alright. Doing all that crap. Which is what it's supposed to. And then there should be a pineapple showing up here anytime soon. Now, this really takes this takes such a long time, I really don't like waiting. <laughs> but I like I'll wait here for you guys to show you exactly how to do it. And then I'll do it one more time from the home screen just to show you that does work. Or you can do that out text. <clears throat> okay, this thing says done, the rest of the process should take place in your device. Alright. <clears throat> text thing. Texting is so fun. Okay, there we go. Charging is not supported with this accessory. Okay, I don't care. Anyways, alright, well that's it. Now, I'll do it again just to show you guys that it works from home screen. Now, connect your iPad, connect your iPad from your computer, and connect it to your wall charger. And make sure your wall charger is connected also. Wherever you connect your wall charger, I'm not going to tell you where it's connected. Hold the power and home button until it turns off, then count to three. One, two, three. Let go of the power button. Hold the home button there. As you can see, the freaking. Apple logo did not show up, which is good. It's it always shows up on three, but it's it's not supposed to. So I don't really know the science behind it. I don't know why it does show up and it doesn't show up when you turn it to the wall charger. That's uh, about 15 seconds, I guess. Now open up your red snow. 
select <coughs> just put tether and then when you connect it yep text it automatically show up <coughs> alright there we go everything else is done you can uh, this is my like second this is like my third time doing this stupid video the first time uh, I freaking uh, didn't select my IS my ISP or I think it's what it's called ISPW or something like that. I didn't select it, so when I entered, when I tried just boot tether, it was stuck on identifying. So I had to restart the video because I don't like to put cuts in my video. And then the second time, uh, when it was my freaking uh, Camtasia was compiling, something happened with the audio, and that's it, guys. And that's uh, how you put your device into DFU mode and boot tether, I guess. Um, yeah. You guys like my uh, thing? It's the Mac, o the Mac OS X. I like, I like the, the little icon. Anyways, okay. Just watch you guys. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, and comment if you have any questions. All right. Well, after that, that's it. Thanks.